Mahmoud Ahmadinejad went to uh, Caracas to uh, attend the funeral of Hugo Chavez. They were very good friends, it makes sense. Uh, but happened to create a huge controversy in Iran over this. Why? Well, he hugged the grieving mother of Hugo Chavez, uh, Alina Freyas de Chavez. And, and there it is. Now, you can see obviously why this is huge controversy. I can't believe he did this. How dare he? Oh my God, I am so angry. Remind me what I'm angry about? <laughs> so, the good people of Iran, or some of them, of course, uh, have decided that this was unacceptable because it is haram. No, not like haram, like, hey, go get him, Mahmoud, you know what I'm saying? Nice haram. No, haram, as in an unacceptable sin. Now, there's a lot of different ways of translating haram, but basically it means sin. sin. So, what was the sin? He's touching a woman there. Cheek to cheek. Oh no! Will God ever recover? <laughs> I mean, really? You think this is a grave offense towards Allah? Man, he gets easily offended if that's the case. I mean, she's a grieving mother. Her son died. This is one of her son's good friends. They can't do that? Oh, that's crazy, man. Now, uh, Influential legislator and religious leader Mohammed Tagri Rabar said Ahmadinejad had lost control. <laughs> what is? <laughs> are you serious? Look at this picture. I mean, he might have lost control, as in like he was really sad that his buddy died. I mean, look, Ahmadinejad is a goofy guy, and I've got a hundred different criticism of him. One of which is that he literally said on his own website that Hugo Chavez would come back with Jesus during the resurrection. Can you imagine the look on the fundamentalist Christian's face here in America? Oh, thank God, there's Jesus. What sick and what's Hugo Chavez doing there? <laughs> okay, so I'm an Indian Chavez, a goofball, and there's a million reasons to criticize him, including by the fact, by the way, the rigged elections in Iran that put him in charge in, in the first place back in 2009. But this is not one of the reasons to criticize him. Let him go! Let him go! One of his aides first said, oh, the telegraph that took that picture, it was a obvious crude uh, photoshopping. I mean, obviously, the president would never show sympathy to a grieving mother in that way. Uh, later, they had to admit, yeah, maybe not Photoshop, that, that picture was kind of true. <laughs> Man, I, I believe Iran has bigger problems than this. I'm pretty sure of it.